Today on Kill Kids News. We're at Myth Junior at the south of France. That's where the grown-ups get to choose the TV shows that us kids get to watch. I get to find the coolest content and I get to source it out and put it on our TV channel so that kids around the world can be entertained. Kia ora, this is Rose reporting for Kia Kids News. In Cannes, France, every year, thousands of TV shows and TV show makers get to come and show off their cartoons. Kia Kids News got to ask some of them what's hot in kids TV. First, we have Sarah. Hi, Sarah. Tell us all about your job. Hi, everyone. I'm Sarah, and I've got the best job in the world because I get to choose the shows for kids aged over seven years old for the BBC in the UK. What's excited about Kids TV on BBC? This year I'm particularly excited to be premiering Pokemon Horizons. It's going to be very big for us. We've also got more series of our great football show, Jamie Johnson, and Mallory Towers, based on the Enid Blyton books. And a fabulous show set in a football academy, all about real life kids who are really excellent at football and sport. We've got loads of animal shows. We've got a new cookery show from Jamie Oliver's son, Buddy, and lots, lots more. We hear you're a bit of a Pokemon fan. I am a total real fan and a nerd, and I've loved Pokemon for years, and I still play Pokemon Go, which really embarrasses my kids. They really don't like to be with me when I'm doing it, even though they're grown up now. What do kids like in the UK? Well, I think British kids are like all kids. They like great storytelling and characters, and they like to have a laugh. And they're obviously really concerned too about the environment and what's going on in the world. And we do try to reflect that for them as well in a range of programs like Blue Peter, which is 65 years old and the oldest television program for children in the entire world. So apart from that, I'm now looking for things from all over the world that might be fun. Then we met Katie from Wild Brain. Hi Kia Kids, my name is Katie and I work at an amazing company called Wild Brain out of Canada. And as part of my role, I get to find the coolest content, um, animation, live action, whatever kids want to watch, and I get to source it out and put it on our TV channel so that kids around the world can be entertained. Cool, sounds fun. Now tell us about your favorite shows. That is so hard because I have so many, but I would have to say right now I love Strawberry Shortcake. That's one of my favorites. I grew up with Strawberry Shortcake, but there's a whole bunch of new Strawberry Shortcake content out there that I love. I love the miraculous tales of Ladybug. It's got a lot of action and it's set in the city. It's so much fun. And if I would have to tell you what my favorite show was as a kid, it would have to be Gem and the Holograms. I love the music and I love the dancing and that's what made me want to get into kids TV because it was such a big part of my childhood. Can you tell us about the new strawberry shortcake? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I was able to work with the amazing Wild Brain team in bringing out a whole new era of strawberry shortcake. So there's a whole bunch of new content that you can watch on YouTube, but we're also producing some beautiful 44 minute specials that are going to be so exciting. The one that we just launched was around Halloween, so it has a lot of spooky elements, and it's called Strawberry Shortcake and the Beast of Berry Bog, and it is so much fun. I think you guys are gonna love it. Then we met the boss of PBS. Hi, kids. My name is Adriano Schmidt, and I'm here in Cannes, France. I work for PBS Kids, which is a public TV channel and platform and games platform in the US. What is PBS all about? Our mission is to make sure that you see yourselves represented on our screen, that you learn about other kind of kids, and that you're also able to learn and have a positive takeaway and really kind of like exercise your curiosity. What is PBS most famous for? There's one show that I'm sure you're familiar with that uh, has been with PBS kids for the longest time, which is Sesame Street. Right? I'm sure you know that show. But there are other ones that are, have been much successful in the past. The most recent one that we are really excited about is Wild Crafts, which is about these two brothers. And they go oh, around the world and then they help animals and learn about animals. This is a show that we're launching next year and it's about Lila. 
Her family runs this diner, and she has a really cool friend here, Stu. It's just like about her adventures with Stu and learning a lot about how, you know, the world works. Thanks, Adriana. Click on the next story for more cool updates on cartoons happening around the world. This has been Rose reporting for Kia Kids News. Thanks to New Zealand On Air.